Hi! Welcome to another Tech Tips channel. Hi, how are you? Have you tried out the NPO Photo Studio? Isn't it cool? If you haven't tried it out, you may refer to my existing video. Just click the link here. Alright, today, let me share with you, how to easily remove the image background, and create a photo montage. Let's start now. Open the photo cutter, and then open the image which ready for removing background. I am going to use this image, to demonstrate how easily removing the background. First, click on the mark the area to erase icon. And then, adjust the brush size. Next, use the brush to highlight the background that going to remove. The background, by using some algorithm, it will be removed automatically. Once background removed completely, let's recover those over cut area. Click on the mark the areas to keep icon. And then, highlight those area that we would like to recover. Once everything is fine, then proceed to the photo montage. Photo montage allows us to changing the background easily. And we may reposition or resize the photo, by just drag and drop. Let's proceed to change the background. There are many preloaded background available. But we are not limited to that. We may import our prefer background, or just use the solid color as background. To make the photo more interesting, I will use the preloaded background. Click on the image to change the background. Then reposition and resize the object. To make it more interesting, let's add some text. And add some stickers. Lastly, adding some cutout object. Done, let's save the image. We may save the image as different format, like JPG or PNG or TIFF file. This is our final result. You may notice that, there are some white area, at the right elbow of the man. To fix it, we may go back to the photo cutter. In the photo cutter, back to the cutter module. Let's zoom in to check. For this problem, we may use the erase the marking to erase the exceed marking. It looked better now. Let's back to the photo montage. Alright, the white area is gone. You may use the same step to trim your photo until perfect. That's all for today, thank you. As I mentioned, it is very easy right? I hope this video is helping. If you have any questions or queries, please leave me a comment. We end here today. If you found my video is helping. Please support me by like and share and subscribe to my channel. Thank you. See you guys at the next video. Have a nice day. Bye.